I'm I'm the top. Top. How about Who's, who's the last person that used thermal spec paper? Oh, Jesus. <laughs> what is this? Is that uh, uh, mimeograph? Mimeograph, right? Right. Right. Nobody can say we don't know what will happen if we lose. We know what will happen if we lose. You're going to hear from a bunch of different politicians today, candidates for office, and they're going to tell you, you know, what their positions are, how much uh, they appreciate your support. Hold them to the fire. They got to work for us. It's time for labor to take the front seat at the table. I mean, you know, I've got my pen in my pocket that Rusty talked about. We're going to sign those bills, and we're going to make changes that are going to be positively impacting on Nevada labor and Nevada labor's families. Because that's what it's all about. That's why we're here today. And if we flip this seat, if we're lucky enough to flip it this November, which I believe we will, it's going to be because of all of you. here with one simple message today. An attack on one of us is an attack on all of us. And we are being attacked from the highest position in this country right now. The Trump administration's assault on immigrant worker rights is a recipe for driving down wages across the board. Because when you can exploit one of us, you exploit all of us, right? And because of your pushed some times to make sure that I did everything I had to do. I won my primary in a big way, and I don't have a Republican opponent, so I will be back at the 2019 session. Really <laughs> yesterday, a couple members came up to me and asked me, hey, I'm hearing that some legis legislators may be waffling on, on taking out right to work, maybe waffling on collective bargaining. Hey, you know what? We all need to be in that Capitol next session and make sure that doesn't happen. Bring it up. Let's talk about it. Let's not be afraid to confront even our friends. 